Hello everyone, Juicebags here, and I'm back in the Neverwinter open beta on my little level 2 trickster rogue. Let's uh, get back in and check some more stuff out. I wish I had a little bit more time to get leveled up a little bit in this beta. See, I leveled up and earned a new unlock right at the end, so press U, Cloud of Steel. This Cloud of Steel do toss a barrage of blades at your opponent, dealing low damage. The longer you bombard a single target, the more damage. Cloud of Steel will inflict. Awesome. Now, how do I get that down here? What do I want to do with it? It's already there. That's my right click, I'm assuming. Alright, so let's go ahead and uh, continue on. We were lucky to drive Valindra's forces back. Indeed you were. Thank you for aiding the wounded. They wouldn't have survived much longer with all the undead roving about. I'll try to... Broken I'm afraid arrow. I have a gruesome task for you. We've driven Valindra's main army off, but Red Wizard allies are still harassing us with summoned undead. Private Hothidorn is trying to drive them off with his archers, but they're short on ammo. Search the battlefield and scavenge some arrows from the dead, and then take them to Hothidorn. You bet. You know, it is impressive the amount of voiceovers. They're, uh... You don't have to read anything. I mean, not that I'm against reading, but they put a lot of effort into the voiceovers. I will give them that. Yeah, let's check out Cloud of Steel. I wonder what the range is. Well, dang! Right, so there's some loot. That cloud of steel is pretty badass. There is no doubt about that. What's this guy up to, Makos? I will answer your questions if I can, but do not break my concentration. It appears that I already have. Valindra had a Dracolich under her control when she attacked Neverwinter. It attacked ships in the harbor, and then came straight for the city. My friends and I were helping Sergeant Knox defend the walls when it attacked. There was a terrific battle, and we were able to defeat it. I don't know how Valindra got a Dracolich. Perhaps a deal with the Cult of the Dragon. The important thing is that we deprive her of it. When a Dracolich is killed, its spirit returns to a special phylactery. From there, it can possess the body of another dragon and be reborn. This Dracolich's spirit has not departed yet. I am trying to bind it here. If it cannot return to the phylactery, we may be able to destroy it and deprive Valindra of a powerful ally. Well, good luck with that there, homie. Mr. Makos. Well, that is just too badass. Mm. Indeed it is. Ooh, what have we got? An orb. Better take that orb. I want to get me some stealth going here soon. More arrows. So I need three more arrows. A rogue with a ranged ability like that. Good lord, that is incredible. Oh, 
Oh, Ryan, I gotta go store these arrows in a barrel. I still can't get over that. That's so awesome. <laughs> Oh, you get wrecked. I'm all healed up already. So you gotta put these arrows in a barrel. There you go, archers. Oh yeah, you spray them arrows now. There's only nine of them now. Don't get carried away. We must drive the wizards back. Oh, Thank we're going. you for the help. The red wizards haven't been driven away, but this will at least force them to keep their heads down. Yes, it will. Sleeping Dragon Bridge, level three. Oh no! More undead are attacking Neverwinter. They're boiling out of Castle Never and storming the Sleeping Dragon Bridge. If the bridge falls, they will enter the heart of the city. Protectors Enclave. Well, that's no I good. must stay and deal with the Red Wizards. Please, go to the bridge and aid the defenders. Destroy the undead soldiers near the gate to our north so it may be open safely. Then talk to Private Wilfred. He will get you inside the city and show you the way to the bridge. Be careful. These undead are more aggressive than others you fought. Tempest grant you strength. All right, I got something new. Dazing Strike. See, Dazing Strike, snap into the air, catching your opponent with a crushing blow to their head. The impact causes your opponent to be dazed for several seconds. Fantastic. Alright, let me uh, find somebody to give the old Dazing Strike to here. Yeah. Well, dang. Not a very long cooldown on that one either. So awesome. Alright, so let's get moving here. Dazing Strike hits hard. Alright, now where was I going? Up here, I believe? Yeah. I don't know where the hell I'm going. There's all kinds of skellies up there, though. They need to go down. Getting wrecked. The uh, combat is very intuitive. It uh, you hit the button and it happens. There's no lag issues or uh, any sort of delay with the abilities, which is kind of nice. See, I'm still just killing all dead soldiers here. I love that. Uh, my tasing strike hits hard. I wonder what the range is on this. Let's see the max range. It's not quite up yet. One more second. <laughs> Out of range. There we go. That's uh that's pretty decent. <laughs> Yeah, the range is solid. This little uh, trickster rogue has been fun so far. Definitely like the combat style. Here's Private Wilfred. What up, Wilfred? Hello again. You're looking a good deal fiercer than when you washed up on the beach. Told you drying out by the fire would do you good. 
My mother always says warm clothes make for a warm heart. That's right. You've thinned out the skeletons enough that we should be able to slip through the gate safely. Linkletter gave me some healing potions for you. You may need them on the bridge. Awesome. Left click on a visible location to travel to it. Aha. So then here's the instancing. How we get from zone to zone. Ooh, we get a little cinematic. They're Shit in hit trouble. the fan. We must go to their aid. Getting, uh, we're getting bombarded. Take <laughs> that, Mr. Archer. You cannot shift when your stamina is low. and getting wrecked. Looks nice. like my health is still holding up. <laughs> oh, Wilfred's a little badass, isn't he? This bridge is getting tore up. No loot. Not much loot dropping. Anxious. I'm not sure what uh, what class I'm going to check out next. I figured I'd better try out one of the ranged classes next time. But on the same note, uh oh. That block white. Oh yeah. Flashing from target to target, dealing damage to each. Bloodbath. I'm gonna have to try me some bloodbath here. Let's see. Oh. Well, Bloodbath just wrecked them all. Oh yeah, we're getting it done. Uh oh, it's boss. Valindra! Valindra is going to tear us up. Oh. <sighs> Alright, here goes. The first boss fight. See if we can't get up on this guy. He's a chomp. The car bringer is getting getting it brought to him. Private Wilford got his ass handed to him. Sorry. Should have been more cautious. Yeah, you should have. Thought of all my friends who died because of her. 
Find Sergeant Knox. Tell him what happened. Ask him to check on my mother from time to time. I'll go check on your mom there, Wilfred. Make sure she's all good. You have to stop her. Lord Never Ember is no saint, but he's better than the alternative. If Never Ember fails here, Valindra will rule Never Winter. Well, that is unacceptable. Like Sergeant Knox. He's one of Never Ember's guards. One of the good ones. You must stop Valindra. All right, Wilfred. I'll get it done. Oh, Wilford's dead. So that was the uh, the starter area, I'm assuming. And now I get to run out into big boy land. There we go, there's some folks. I'm out of the starter area, I'm into the into the city. Oh, he's got him a horse already. Look at that. I guess I haven't been playing uh, playing the beta much. I had a long work week. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, call it good for episode two. I'm at the South City Gate. Thanks for watching. Click that like button and please subscribe. Thanks again.